These programs impact agriculture, and there are programs around the world, international corporations are modifying our weather all the time, and they're modifying it in ways that cover thousands and thousands of square miles. Most of it is chemically altered, so that what happens is that we are putting chemicals, ground-based chemicals that are shot into the air, or chemicals coming from airplanes that change and modify our weather. So one of the things that I'm concerned about and that we need to address in the future is how these programs are impacting microclimates needed for our crops to survive and needed for pollination. Um, if we change the growing season, the pollinators may not survive and also our crops, our flowers and our tree crops may not get the pollination needed. So one of my areas is looking at this situation to see if we can begin to put under control experimental and other types of weather modification programs. Our old our society is run by insane people for insane objects, mm. objectives. You know, yeah. And I think that's what I sussed when I was 16 and 12, way down the line. But I expressed it differently all through my life. It's the same thing I'm expressing all the time. But now I can put it into that sentence that I think we're being run by maniacs for maniacal mean, uh, ends, you know. If, if anybody can put on paper what our government and the American government, etc., and the Russian, Chinese, what they are actually trying to do, you know, and how, what they think they're doing. Mm. I'd be very pleased to know what they think they're doing. I think they're all insane. You know, but I'm liable to be put away as insane for expressing that. <laughs>